Hey guys, I hope you've been doing well and I hope that you're keeping safe. When the new OS is out, we definitely want to get in on those new features and more importantly, we want those security updates. But with aging devices, we have this simple thought in the back of the head. What if my device slows down? And the M1 MacBook Air has been around for two years now and it's definitely not the upgrade cycle for most users. For me, I'm planning to use the device for about 10 years. Anyway. With all the stock aside, I did a Geekbench test on macOS and then on Ventura. So this Mac, it actually came with Big Sur, which was pretty fantastic. And Monterey made things better. Now let's see if Ventura lives up to the mark. First, I did a CPU test and then a compute test. So this is the result of the CPU test. And now let's run the compute test on Monterey. I'm just cutting the pieces of it so you don't have to sit through all of it. So this is the score for the older OS Monterey. If you can pause the video, see uh, the scores individually, how they're stacking up. And then I daringly went ahead and installed Ventura, which is a pretty big download. And once Ventura was up, I did a Geekbench test again on the CPU and the compute benchmarks. And remarkably guys, the macOS Ventura has marginally improved the compute score and the single core and the multi-core GPU scores. Marginal improvement, but that's remarkable. So yeah, there you have it. Uh, and I have been using this new OS on this two year old machine for about four days now. And I have to say that there is no drop in performance at all. In fact, Safari seems to load a tad bit faster. So that's all I have, guys. Uh, hope you found this informative and I hope I helped you make a decision. Thank you so very much for watching and have a fantastic day ahead. Pause the video towards the end. I took screenshots for you to quickly compare the scores. I hope that helps. So thank you. Peace.